from Newsnet and CCTV, it's High School Hockey, coming to you from the WEX in Cadillac. All right, welcome back, everybody, to the post-game show. You are watching High School Hockey on Newsnet Sports and CCTV. Traverse City Central has just defeated the Cadillac Vikings 8-0 in a, in a shortened game after the second period. And, um, Jeff, before we get with our... Uh, our uh, wrap up can we just get one more time here to let people know about our dvds and stuff yeah absolutely now that we've wrapped the season up our dvd copies can be purchased individually or box sets for the whole season the sale of these dvds helps pay for the cost of production contact yournewsnet.com they make great gifts and they're great keepsakes to have what a nice thing it is to have uh, these dvds to play for years to come watching your player your grandson your nephew whatever it happens yeah. to be yeah uh, on the team this broadcast is also a cooperation between Wexford Masaki Career Tech Center CCTV and Newsnet students are involved in directing replay editing and cam work all under the supervision of a professional director and it's a, just a great thing that they've got going here and uh, a lot of people really love these broadcasts so we hope to be able to keep bringing them to you all right, and now our wrap-up for the scoring for Traverse. It's going to be all Traverse City, and uh, we're just going to kind of go over the, the main goals scored. Yeah, right. So uh, starting off, we had Charlie Douglas leading the way, number 17. He had the hat trick tonight and also had a helper to go with it. Uh, go that will give, uh, that'll give Charlie 25 goals and now 26 assists right. for him. Yeah, quite a year so far. Uh, Nick Somerville had uh, two goals and also a helper. It'll be 22 for him, and along with 18 assists. All right, nice year. And then uh, single goals, one by number 10, Ethan Vanderroost. That's his 14th of the season. One by Chris Usandik, and he also had two assists tonight. Okay, that'll be a 17th goal, along with 14 assists. And uh, rounding out the scoring was uh, Josh Stepke. All right, he scored his third of the year for Stepke. All, All right. So these teams will head off to finish up their season with one more game as Traverse City plays at Alpena and Cadillac will play at Sheboygan and then it's pre-regionals for both teams and we went over who they will be playing already if we finish that up. Um, we want to thank our crew tonight, Hannah Crouch, our director, along with Zach Wiggins, Miley Hilkowski, and Damian Brooks on the camera. Good job this season uh, during this frigid temperatures. Uh, you know, tro troopers, you know, out in the snow in the, with the van and coming in. So they did a great job. We appreciate that. Um, Jeff, our sponsors one more time. Uh, we've got Cadillac Tire, Pizza Plus, and Fox Motors of Cadillac. And a big thank you to you, Bill. I appreciate all you do for these making these broadcasts uh, what they are. And as always, it was great working with you. We had a, uh, another great season. Yeah, and we want to um, let people know that we've got four games left with girls basketball and boys basketball. So um, Derek Tate and Dan Gussert will be bringing the action. And uh, if you get a chance, you know, tune in and watch some of the, you know, the uh, action for basketball. Yeah, they're both tearing it up, both the girls and the boys. They're doing great. So um, we will say goodbye. It's going to be hard to say goodbye until next hockey season. Um, once again, our final score here from the Wexen Cadillac, the Traverse City Central Trojans 8 and the Cadillac Vikings nothing. Good night, everyone. Good night.